Vancouver is trying to come up with a plan now to crack down on graffiti. Now, residents and businesses say it is a big problem, and the city really doesn't have much power yeah. to fix it. Well, Chris Holmstrom live with the facts of some new city rules that could really change things. Chris? That's right, Jeff. And most of the vandalism happens at nighttime, and it's usually young people in low-income neighborhoods. But the truth is, is it could happen anywhere. And in Vancouver, it's a hard crime to enforce. It's the never-ending problem, graffiti. They must be on skateboards. They just come down and they'll just start, you know, tagging it. And they've tagged the windows. We change them out all the time. And Sometimes you have to look really close to see it. But when it does happen, it's another bill for businesses. When it's tagged and they aren't caught, nobody, I mean, we pay for it out of our own pocket as a business owner. But how do you cut back on graffiti? City leaders I spoke with say by adding tougher laws. In fact, I found out in Vancouver there are no laws that address graffiti directly. So police can only arrest people they catch in the act. Something Assistant City Attorney Philip Gigler is hoping to change. Under the new proposed ordinance, not only would graffiti be specified as a crime specifically, um, possessing graffiti implements would now be criminalized as well. I found out the proposal would also have an impact on homeowners. What it comes down to is if someone vandalizes is your property, you'll be required to pay for cleanup immediately. Our uh, minimum property maintenance code um, holds property owners responsible for maintaining their area. And this would just add uh, speci specifically graffiti um, at, in that whole code. But that's not all. The proposal would also target parents who have kids that are repeat offenders. So if your kid is caught vandalizing more than once, you could get a fine. Something this business owner and mother would like great. to see. I mean, if my kids were out graffitiing, I would, you know, hang them by their feet and, you know, make them come up over here and clean off the building also. And back out here live, City Council and Mayor will vote on this proposal this summer. Reporting live in Vancouver, I'm Chris Holmstrom, Coin Six News. Chris.